All right, now, people, now that I have your attention, check this shit out. Now, even though Diddy it has the these YouTube streets all in a frenzy, but let's not forget that those are distractions, people. And there's a bigger picture going on right before our very eyes. Now, check this out. Migrants crossing border through hole in fence. Through a damn hole in the fence. Trying to run past the border patrol. Look at them. This is what we still dealing with, people, though. You know what I'm saying? We still dealing with these things that's going on, people. These people really want to get over here. You know what I'm saying? And, and it's looking like it could possibly be that they'll be taking the places of certain people that don't want to get out of here and be productive, all right? Or if you wait too late, it won't be nothing out there for your ass. That's it. Won't be nothing left for you. Now, a parent... Human smugglers are not deterred by the border fence in Lukeville, Arizona. News Nation cameras were there to see them sending migrants through a hole they created in the fence. They created that damn hole. You hear me? All the Border Patrol agent can do is implore them not to cross over into the United States. So you mean to tell me the Border Patrol can only say, hey... Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> All the Border Patrol agent can do is implore them not to cross over into the United States. This shit is crazy, people. In other words, they ass is coming. Whether it's through a hole in the fence or a hole in the wall or a hole in the ground, they ass is coming. They ass is coming to town. Understand me, all right? Now, what do we have here? Perfect solar system found. NASA satellites discover a six-planet in sync solar system. Now, when I seen this, I said, this reminds me of in the Bible when they say a new heaven and a new earth. They're saying this is a perfect solar system found. NASA astronomers have found their own. It is a rare in sync solar system. With six planets moving like a grand cosmic orchestra, untouched by outside forces since the birth billions of years ago. Watch this report to know more about this new world and where it is located. People, like I said, when I seen this, I said, damn, that remind me of what they're saying. The Bible say there would be a new heaven and a new earth. Yeah, people, what you think about that? NASA astronomers have found what? Their own? What do you mean they have found their own? It is a rare in sync solar system with six planets moving like a grand cosmic orchestra untouched by outside forces since the birth billions of years ago. Could this be the mothership, though, coming to get our black ass? I don't know, people. Y'all make y'all decision on that shit. But I just thought that was hella interesting. Let's keep going. Anthrobots can heal damaged tissue. Scientists create tiny living robots from human cells. Tiny living robots from human cells. And they are called anthrobots. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. They saying it can heal you, but scientists in the United States have created tiny biological robots from human tracheal cells. These robots are known as anthrobots, and these microscopic multicellular bots have displayed a remarkable healing effect on other cells. Like I said, I don't know if this is a good or bad thing. It could be a good thing, and I feel like it can also be a bad thing. I guess we have to find out. All right, now. Let's keep going. And this is what it kind of looked like. Scientists developed the first living robots. The first living robots. Because, see, when they talking about robots and shit, that's like uh, some type of nanotechnology-ass shit in my eyes. And it's basically making me feel like, will you be some type of technology as well? You feel me? Yeah, that shit, I don't know. Like I said, it could be a good or a bad thing, people. Do your research. 
Now, let's check this out. FDA, Food Drug Administration, United States Department of Health and Human Services, Food and Drug Administration, new anti-aging drug waiting for FDA approval. But guess what? This ain't for humans. It's for your pets. Yeah, it's for your pets. Anti-aging. See, what I think they doing is, allegedly, I feel like they experimenting on these damn animals. But right now, to see if they can reverse their aging. You know what I'm saying? But what it says, it says new anti-aging drug waiting for the FDA approval. Oh, they going to prove that shit. You know what it is. Now, that's why they, they just waiting patiently. All right. Tie up the loose ends. Pneumonia troubles the Netherlands. Now, if y'all remember about a week ago or so, I ain't talked about no real shit in about a week or a little bit over a week. And I was telling y'all about China. China had an outbreak of a mysterious pneumonia. And what I said, if you remember, go back to them videos. I said, watch it come over here. Watch it come over here. I give it two weeks I talked about this. Between a week and two weeks I talked about this. Yeah, it might be one of the videos that say untitled on it. But anyway, pneumonia troubles the Netherlands. Now it's over there in the Netherlands. Pneumonia outbreak in China. Pneumonia cases in children in United States raises. Look, look, look. Let's keep going. White lung syndrome. Ohio sees record pediatric pneumonia outbreak china netherlands ohio let's keep going here let's see let's see what they talking about though people an extremely high number of children hold on now an extremely high number of children are being hospitalized in ohio as an outbreak of pediatric pneumonia cases dubbed white lung syndrome is causing concern among parents worried the spread of the illness is linked to a surge in similar cases in China and other countries around the globe. Told y'all it was coming. Dr. Tom Frieden, or whatever the hell his name, former director of the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, joins the Hill on News Nation to discuss the outbreak. Frieden also discusses Anthony Fauci who is expected to testify before Congress early next year as a part of Republicans' years-long investigation into the origins of the COVID-19. But let me tell you something. That shit is patent. So, uh, yeah, allegedly, it's man-made, all right? And we know that shit. So uh, when they say extremely high number of children are being hospitalized, people from this outbreak of uh, pneumonia, that's bad. That's worse than uh, this COV shit, all right? It's worse than that. Not only do they have this shit for the humans, they got a mysterious respiratory shit going on with your pets. I, I feel like they saying you're going to get this shit one way or another. Huh? You're going to get this shit one way or another. We need this shit to spread, spread. You see what I'm saying? Now, can you imagine having this mysterious pneumonia outbreak like that cough cough sneeze thing was and you had to get the jab check it out that's another lockdown for your ass this shit spread it fast i was just talking about this like a week ago hold on now it might have been less than a week ago i'm just saying time go fast and now i said that too i said it's gonna come over here watch because anything that be happening in china as far as sickness all of a sudden, it's over here. Now, how the fuck it get over here that fast? And we got some mysterious shit going on with the pets. China's mysterious pneumonia outbreak, people. A spike in respiratory illness seen in China. Look, But I want y'all to understand, look at they mask. What type of mask they be wearing and shit. You know them, them N95s, but them some big, big jokers, though. Like, you know what I'm saying? Um, Yeah. And they air ain't never been together any damn way before this shit. So China set to export another killer pandemic? Question mark? Huh? Huh? China set to export another killer pandemic? All about the mysterious pneumonia. 
Now, you know damn well, pneumonia ain't nothing to play with. Rest in peace to Kim Porter. All right? Rest in peace to Kim Porter. They said she had pneumonia. Diddy? Diddy? They said she had pneumonia, boy. Let's keep going. An outbreak of child pneumonia or white lung syndrome. See, this, this mysterious pneumonia, they got another name for it. They say, well, you know what? It be turning people's lungs white. So we going to call it white lung syndrome. Cases across the world, including China and Europe, has led to an outbreak in the United States. They didn't say one person had it. They said it's an outbreak. Huh? You know when somebody get the measles, they got an outbreak. Get away from their ass. They contagious. You see what I'm talking about? The CDC says it believes the illness is caused by a multitude of viruses and bacteria. And it's not new or novel. So this ain't no new shit. But allegedly, they just not bringing it out to our ass. Oh, no, we know ain't none of this shit new, don't we, people? We know ain't none of this shit new or novel. Whatever the fuck that supposed to mean. You see? But I know one damn thing. Y'all waited for the perfect time. W what, what Biden say? Biden said that it's going to be another pandemic. Come on now. Stop fucking playing with us. We ain't slow. We got a lot of distractions out here, but hey, hey. We know what's going on, right? Right. I got to read that shit again. An outbreak of child pneumonia or white lung syndrome. Y'all better pay attention to your children. Huh? That's why I always preach you need to homeschool your child. Right? Somebody in the household got to make a sacrifice. You got to stop. You got to get a, a job that you can work from home. Whatever the case may be, man. This shit right here, this pneumonia shit, you don't want your child getting that shit and you sure the fuck don't want it. You too old to be getting that shit and the child too young to be getting that shit. So either way, it's a lose-lose situation, people. Come on now. An outbreak of child pneumonia or white lung syndrome cases across the world, including China and Europe, has led to an outbreak in the United States. How did it do it so fast, people? The CDC says... It believes the illness is caused by a multitude of viruses. You know what multitude mean? Like multiple, like a, a whole bunch of viruses and bacteria all in one. <laughs> Lord help us, all right? May God be with us all. New York City scrambling to find migrant shelter amid cold temperatures. They come through holes and back of 18 wheelers and all in the man, they coming from the air, land, and sea to this motherfucker. Understand this shit, people? Just to live like this. They don't give a damn because they know one of them days. Y'all gonna put us in one of these buildings y'all building for us. No, the shelters is too good for you. We gonna put you in. In the goddamn brand new building we gonna build for y'all ass. And guess what? We still ain't gonna put the damn homeless people in the fucking shelters where they ass should be. But we gonna let y'all get they spot on the goddamn sidewalk. Now see how they got the barrier things right here? Like what the fuck? Do we do the homeless like that? Where it's like don't touch them, let them chill. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah, nah. We ain't doing the homeless like that. God damn. And this is our tax money that's going to these people, man. They just getting a free fucking ride, bro. Damn. It's crazy. See what this is? PA sees Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania sees cases of dog mysterious mystery illness you see what i'm saying pennsylvania see cases of mis mystery dog illness i can't even get it out because it's not just the humans got some mysterious shit going on your damn pets might have something going on with their ass and that motherfucker looks strange don't he didn't turn them into a damn rat all right keep going now this feast your eyes on this you see that black man 
Black men across the United States wrongfully jailed through facial recognition technology. And if you woke, when they first talked about this facial technology shit, year or two ago, guess what? Motherfuckers already knew that was going to happen because they can mistake. You can be mistaken. You see what I'm saying? A lot of people got the same type of features and shit, bro. Even though you might not even be some kin in that person. But look what it say. Black men across the United States wrongfully jailed through facial recognition technology. And you're going to have to sit your $5 ass in there trying to, to, to try to make change to get out. Because guess what? They got to make sure you ain't th who they looking for. They got to go through all that motion. Oh, no, they ain't going to believe you and say, that ain't me. The hell you talking about? They about wouldn't even care if you gave up a driver's license or an ID. They still taking your ass down. They got to figure this shit out. Ain't that something? Black men, wake your $5 ass up. You know what I'm saying? You better wake your $5 ass up. Black men across the United States wrongfully jailed through facial recognition technology. You better wake your ass up. Quit playing. 60 norovirus whatever that is norovirus 60 norovirus cases traced to suburban chicago restaurant big wig and this is in the suburbs investigators claim they traced the illnesses to big wig tacos and burritos damn near the northwestern university campus all of those who got sick apparently ate there on November 18th. Oh, I never heard of norovirus, but check this shit out. Uh, the desert has frozen. Huh? The hot desert of Saudi Arabia freezes and devastates the land, animals, and people. Worldwide change. Ain't that something? The hot deserts of Saudi Arabia freezes and devastates the land, animals, and people. I never thought that the, I mean, anything's possible, but I don't, I don't think I ever heard of the desert freezing. I mean, I could be wrong, but I don't know, people. I mean, is them camels and shit with all snow on their ass and whatnot? Yeah, them camels and shit. Yeah, people. Yeah, people, what the hell? Reward, $3 million. Is that $3 million? Look like $3 million. All right. Reward for charge with conspiracy to import and distribute fentanyl into the United States. Uh-huh. $3 million reward for information leading to the arrest and or conviction of Nestor Isidro Perez Salas. And this guy is an, uh, Sinaloa. Cartel's alleged security chief for El Chapo's sons arrested in Mexico. His ass been arrested. Now, Nestor Isidro Perez Salas allegedly protected the sons of imprisoned drug lord Joe Quinn El Chapo Guzman and also helped in their drug business. He allegedly left a trail of murder and torture behind him in Mexico. All right. Let's go back to his Scarface ass. Yeah. Ain't that something he don't look like he'll do? You know who I'm done? I don't know. He like, I don't know. Them be one you got to look out for. Oh, shit. So here we go. I thought they been uh, cancel Roseanne Barr. But Roseanne Barr yells terroristic Threats at Trump rally. Roseanne Barr blankly shouts terroristic threats at Make America Great Again rally. I tell you, that damn Roseanne Barr bout it, bout it. I ain't lying. I ain't lying, man. That lady, she, I, don't, I can't believe she ain't never ran for president. Big ass mouth she got. But uh, yeah, man, she, uh, Roseanne Barr is a uh, choir taste, all right? Now check this fool out. Now this is the guy. He just, oh, now nah, this is the same guy that was on higher learning with Ice Cube in them, man. Yeah, the skinhead mofo. Now, this guy is saying, and shout out to uh, 
redirecting with proverbs i think but anyway uh that she is saying is he being a light to the world like the chosen were commanded jewish actor michael rapaport calls black people sick dumb uneducated black tar now let me tell you because this guy he played on higher learning you remember deja you know deja got shot he the motherfucker that shot Deja. He the motherfucker that shot Deja. I just thought about that shit. Yes, you did. On a damn movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, nah, nah. This motherfucker right here, people, said we are. Black people are sick, dumb, uneducated black tar. And wasn't he looking just like that, pointing that finger at Ice Cube and them? Yes, he was. Ice Cube beat that ass. Huh? Yes, he did. He was looking just like that on that fucking movie. Imagine him with no hair. I'm surprised this motherfucker still got hair. Huh? You piece of shit. He been racist, people. That's my thing. Allegedly, he, he played that role. And that was really him. When he was young. Hmm? That's why he played it so good. What? And he's a bitch because he killed Deja. Let's keep going. His ass is canceled. Oh, that's all I got. But fuck his ass because he killed Deja, people. And you know what? His ass is canceled. Message.